Hi everyone, this is Terry with Sweet Stitch and Embroidery and Design. Today I'm going to show you how to adjust the pull compensation in Sew Up Pro so that you can make stitching a little bit wider. If uh, something looks like it's a little bit too thin, you can thicken it up a little bit by just adjusting the pull compensation. I usually don't change the density. Uh, normally if I do it just a little bit, it's enough to where it doesn't really make any difference. So I've got my design here on the screen. And I want to go up to Tools and left click on Adjust Density, or I can use the shortcut of just pressing my Control button in the letter A. So right now we'll just click this, and this brings up the stitch, stitch density and pull compensation. And uh, just uh, ignore this box with the density for right now and adjust the pull compensation. Uh, first, though, you want to adjust the stitch. Here, let's click this off for a second. Let's choose the stitches that we want to uh, change because right now, if I change the pull compensation, I will uh, do it for the entire design and I only want to do it for uh, this word here, pit. So let's go up here to number one. As you can see, there's a box around pit now and that's the only one that I'm wanting to change the pull compensation on. Or, yeah, there we go, the pull. And then uh, if we want to do master also, the stitching down here. I can hold down the control button and I can left click on the number two. So now both of these are highlighted. So now when I adjust the pull compensation, I'll be able to um, do it for both these words. So let's go up here to adjust density, pull compensation, and let's go up twice. Uh, okay, yeah, we'll do that. Hit OK. And you can see it didn't really make much difference, but if I click undo, it does change a little bit. So let's try this again. Let's do hold down the control button and the letter A. And we just did our shortcut. So now let's go pull compensation again. Let's go up to four this time. That's about what I normally do, three or four. I hit uh, OK. And as you can see, we've still got this selected and highlighted. OK. And that just made these a lot thicker. And like I said, I don't normally change the pull compensation. So uh, now all you have to do is just save it. And I recommend first too, whenever you uh, change a design, any kind of editing at all, if this is your only copy, go up to File, do Save As, preferably before you make any changes. And right now I've got Pitmaster. So let's change this to, what I usually do is I'll do REV for revised or uh, thicker, showing that I adjusted the pool, and then do save. And that's all there is to it. I hope you have a great day. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope the videos help.